this is the 2022 range of motorhomes from hobby hobby optima on tour edition and this one is on a citroen so let's have a look at some more details the big question is down here and that's almost 61,000. It's 678 centimeters long and 216 wide. That's an unusual width, but uh, in my opinion, the thinner, the better. That's for me. Others may think something else. And right, it's got uh, my favorite motorhome layout. <laughs> That is to say, with the width wide bed at the back, and it's not a particularly long van. So, that from that point of view, it would uh, that would be alright for me. It doesn't have a double floor though, so uh, that sort of cancels it out for me. Deep um, storage cabinets. I look under the bed. Oh, it's, oh, it comes with the net. A net even in something like that. Well, that's, that's now, I wouldn't say it's unusual. I think there's more and more people like to do that in a formation like that. This, I don't think there's much chance you're falling out of the bed. Well, maybe there is. Yeah. And, oh, lovely wardrobe. Oh, I like that. Nice big one. And here, right next to the bed, is the fridge. Which, if you're in the kitchen, you see, what you do is you'd open it up like that. And you can get your beer out there. And if you're in bed, what happens is this. Alright, so I'd have to pretend that I'm now in bed. I don't want to get up here. Now, in bed, right, so I just have to sort of get out like that. Reach over and get the drinks out. Pretty convenient placing it right next to the bed. So what do you think of that? Any opinions on the verb? Well, write them down below. Up here, what have we got? And, um, okay, uh, kitchen block hobby has this very distinct style with this uh, approach here. Down there, we've got uh, an oven. I mean, you may say, oh, that's a very low oven. Okay then, right, don't want it down here. Where else would you suggest it went? It's not a very big one, but uh, there you go. It's got that much space there. It's, can you see how long it is? Put my hand in. And uh, now people often ask for ovens. They are options. Uh, even in larger vans, there are options. When people who manufacture large built-to-order motorhomes, they tell me that it's, here in Germany, it's unusual that people ask for an oven. Very large shower. I shall, I shall come into it to demonstrate. Look at all the space you've got. All of this space around here. Um, but the, the sensible sliding door, though, only slides around the shower. It doesn't slide around the external door. I haven't used one like this. I don't know yet if it's a good idea or not. How far does it go? Right, I shall show you. That's it. Doesn't go any further because there's something here stopping it. 
maybe that would come out anyway. You could just unscrew it and that would come out that far around the toilet. My opinion is that's a bit unpointless. That's a bit pointless. Um, the a bit unnecessary the toilet sort of swings around a bit, I think. Oh, it's a post moment. That can't be right. Ah, no. No. That is one of the toilets that cut, turns around. And it's been put there. Like that. Okay, well. Never mind. Oh, sorry, I missed this. This thing here comes like that. Oh, now we under now I understand what's going on. So I'll come back into the shower. There you go. Seems a bit squashed in here now. Large chair, a large table, and chairs up front. Okay, and nice uh, roof lights. Let's come round. Ah, didn't show this. It's a gas cupboard, cup, and this part here actually, this comes out, and you can. Uh, Easy access for the gas cylinders. You don't want any lifting them if you can avoid it. Very nice, large garage. Bear in mind how short the van is as well. 601 kilos overall payload, but not in the garage. Only a quarter of that will go in the garage. Right, so. Optima on tour edition second one This one has a queen bed And this is called the on tour edition v65 GQ It costs 59,000 euros 7 meters long 216 centimeters wide Different kitchen. This one hasn't got an oven, but you could put one in as an option. Fridge and queen bed. Wardrobes either side, storage above, as always. Chest of drawers below and additional storage down here. Which you can't see because there's no light. What would you prefer? The widthwise bed or the queen bed? And this here is exactly the same, only this one's got some soap and a yellow towel in it. So, uh, that's the Hobby um, Optima on tour edition. Edition, I'll show you one or two of those. I'll just walk around so you can see what else there is here. I've done them all, you can see all the vans, and uh, it'll give you a bit of an idea of what Hobby have to offer for 2022. Yeah, I'm gonna finish off with one round here, 
nothing to do with what we've looked at already but I think this is highly original although highly impractical this beachy van uh, on a Citroen beachy van 540 no price has been given it will enter production in next summer um, it's got a tent in the roof looks like that it looks a bit like a beach house that's been abandoned um, you've got these rails here to actually add uh, chairs and things to it it looks a bit like somebody's home conversion yeah no toilet no shower and no price <laughs> but it's curious And there's some caravans as well to go with it. Okay, right, so that's a walk around a little part of the hobby stand here at Dusseldorf. And I'll take you right back to where I started off from. which was the Optima On Tour edition motorhome so thanks for watching I hope you found that of interest you can see all the hobby motorhomes on this channel thanks for watching